Welcome back everyone to another episode of Advanced WordPress Theme Development. In the previous video, we learned about how to display the smaller chunks of code, the template parts in the content. And we also created the content.php and content none.php. The none takes care of if there are no posts available. And we use these uh, template parts inside of our WordPress D loop to display the post content. In this video, we are going to be focusing on this content.php, which is the template we are loading inside of the WordPress loop. And currently it's rendering the title in the excerpt, but we're going to you know, make this better and display more information uh, into the post. So inside of the post, currently we have a heading. We also want to show when was this post posted, uh, who was the author, etc. We want to be able to show that featured image etc so for that we're going to create small chunks of code uh, and we'll put them into our template parts so let's create a directory inside of this and let's name it as components and inside of components we create another directory called blog so we create we put the blog related uh, templates inside of that and we want to create a template called entry header where our post header related information will be there like the featured image posted by etc and then let's create another one called entry meta okay the meta information like posted by etc I think in the header we can keep the featured image etc but we'll come to that and then entry content this is where your post excerpt and read more stuff like that will stay and then the last one will be entry footer. Maybe we can put the related taxonomies, categories, etc. Okay. Entry footer.php. Great. And I'm going to include all of that inside of my content.php. So I'm going to get rid of all of this and just create a meaningful HTML tag, which is article with an ID of post now inside of the loop I have something available which is called I have a function available called the ID so generally in WordPress things that we that is prefixed by the echoes out and things that are prefixed by get return something okay it may not necessarily be always the same case but this is generally seen a uh, something we have seen that at most places for example the title is going to echo out the title and get the title is going to return the title okay uh, similarly if get the ID is going to return the ID okay so we'll have this ID over here and I want to be able to add call another class called post class so that WordPress applies its default classes that are related to the post like so inside of the post class you can also add additional class for example I want to be able to give some margin on top of each article in fact margin bottom below each article so I can see MB5 which is your bootstrap class okay and then I'll open a PHP tag and inside of this I can just say get template part then template parts slash components components slash blog slash entry header okay so I want to be able to get all of these files so what I'm going to do is just copy this paste it four times and then just rearrange this properly so entry header entry meta entry content and entry footer okay great let's close the content we don't need that let's close all of them all of them so that we can start from entry header first okay mm -hmm. 